All right, welcome back to One Bar and Lupica Show. I'm One Bar Vikings doing what we all expected, but it is now official. They have released defensive lineman Dean Lowry. Before we get into that, remember, subscribe to the channel. We're trying to get 12,000 subs. Hit that sub button. Boom. We'll be back live later talking anything Vikings for agency. Cannot wait. Uh, so, yeah, we knew this was coming. So the Vikings... You know, they, they bring in a, a, a former Packer this morning with Aaron Jones, and now they're releasing a former Packer in Dean Lowry. Dean Lowry, what could have been, uh, you know, he played nine games, started four, uh, had that pectoral injury, ended up going on IR. When we signed Dean Lowry, I got to admit, I was probably a little more excited than I should have been. I mean, not so much that I thought he was going to come in and get us 10 sacks, but I thought he was going to come in and help solidify the defensive line with Harrison Phillips everything blah 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 doesn't matter it just did not pan out it did not pan out and you know when we signed him Packers fans I hit them guys up I mean they said you know you're getting a you're getting a pretty good defensive line you're getting a solid starter he's not going to wow you by any means but he will do just fine I think they were messing with me Dean Lowry did not do fine I wish him the best I hope he signs somewhere uh but he's gone we saved two million dollars which is the, the the most important part of this and really I mean defensive line regardless if we were going to release Dean Lowry or not, is still a huge need. It's not like, holy shit, we just got rid of Dean Lowry. Now a defensive line, we got to address it. It was a need anyways. Dean Lowry wasn't going to start. Dean Lowry, we all know, wasn't going to be back. So this doesn't really change anything, except for the fact we now have $2 million to spend. The other side of that is, we th this might not be the only guy we released today. I mean, we still got to make decisions on Harrison Smith, Garrett Bradbury. It's, it appears he's coming back, but there's guys like that that they still need to figure out before tomorrow. So Dean Lowry could just be the first one. We've seen a lot. The Vikings sign a lot of new players. Maybe today is a day that we get rid of some familiar faces on this squad. So uh, let me know. Dean Lowry, Gonzo, 2 million bucks in our pocket. Uh, yeah. Bye, Dean. Thanks.